Hey everybody, welcome to another tutorial video, and in this one I'll be covering some Skyrim modding. Uh, so let's get right into it, yeah. Uh, the actual topic, like the main topic of this video, is going to be how to get Fnis or Forge New Idols working in Skyrim Special Edition through Mod Organizer 2, so let's get right into it. First, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to download Fnis and a couple of packs uh, from Nexus. So once you download that, download the main file and make sure it's near the top of the uh, load order. Uh, you have a guide about the load, load order on the internet, so search for it and you'll find it. Uh, you have a lot of them, actually, and they're the same for pretty much all Bethesda games. Uh, but yeah, download the main file, make sure it's at the top, then download Creatures and Spells. And that's about it. Uh, make sure that creatures go after spells and make sure they're at their correct spot in the load order. As I've said, refer to another tutorial for that. Uh, once you've done that, just check all of them off uh, here to the left. And once you do, you want to add this Finis executable to Mod Organizer by going to Edit, going to Plus and Add from File. Uh, navigate to your mod file which is Mod Organizer, your Skyrim Special Edition file, Mods, Finis, which is somewhere here. Uh, yeah, here it is. Uh, go into Tools and generate Finis for users, and this is the executable you want. Just name it Finis or whatever you want. Once you do that, you want to run it through Mod Organizer. Make sure you do that because otherwise it won't work. And once you do, select all these patches here if you need them. Uh, click on Update Finis Behavior. And uh, after that, you should get a success message. Here it uh, says successfully loaded with one warning. That doesn't matter for this build since it's broken because I changed files. Click a consistency check. You should get zero consistency issues. Close that down. And then you want to go to override here, uh, down here or wherever you yeah, overwrite. Click create mod and j just type fnis dash output or something like that, uh, which you will see here. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys in another video.